Hey guys, John Eric here with another fantastic uh, $50,000 brick. Uh, this one is a pure mirror finish. Uh, very hard to do, very hard to make it look like this. Uh, this one is not bolted together yet. I'm going to make a very quick video about this. I've got to get this one shipped in a couple of minutes. I'll show you the lid. So, I guess, yeah, that's my chin. There's the lights. With the mirror finish, there's not much to show you other than uh, you know, you gotta reflect it against something. There's no design on it. Uh, now we'll explain one thing on a mirror finish. So if we do a mirror finish on all sides, like for example, if we do a mirror finish here and here, where these two flat spots touch, they're gonna get little chafe marks and it's gonna be noticeable. With the diamond pattern, that kind of eliminates the possibility of having those marks show up. Um, obviously when you rub any metal together, it's going to make a mark, but I just want to give you a quick overview. Um, I keep getting lint on this. I guess we have dust in our building, but we mirror finished the whole thing. I see some fingerprints here. We'll wipe this down one more time before we send out the client. Just want to do a quick video and show you guys uh, how it looks. It looks pretty cool. And of course the bottom came out nice. We do the diamonds on the bottom as well. If you set this on a surface, it's not quite level and this is all uh, flat mirror finished what's gonna happen is little scratches are gonna start showing up I know the feet lifted up off a little bit, but not enough that something wouldn't rub that and uh, put some marks on it So the diamond pattern helps to hide the the blemishes that it's that are gonna happen. There's kind of no way around that So I'm gonna show you guys uh, this fits $50,000 just like promised This is fake money. I use this in my videos now because I got some haters I swear they were gonna kill me and rob me uh, because I used to use real money in my videos. There's 20,000, 30,000, 40,000, 50,000. There's still a little bit of room in there. Um, we'd make them a little bit larger because real money is going to have, uh, most likely, is going to have some wrinkles in it. It might even set up an inch taller than the brick if that's the case. It's a real simple fix. Take the lid, match up the 50K with the 50K here. Put it down. It's got little uh, stainless steel alignment rings that go in there. Set it down. Flip it over. The weight of that lid will definitely pull down the uh, or mash down the money. And we did some pretty spectacular bolts also. Let's see if I can get a good image of this. Not sure. There you go. So we sand down uh, the heads. Uh, the shaft and of course the top as well. We machine all the lines off from the factory bolts And of course we give you a very nice polished tool as well And that's it that's your 50k brick this one has fifty thousand dollars worth of fun money in it Or actually you could call it funny money not much to say about this when the client uh, found me on YouTube Said, man, that looks like a beautiful thing I like to have. Pop the screws out real quick. This is also a demo for him so he knows how to handle it. And I will give a piece of advice to the owner, the guy getting the brick, is we have this white foam that we use to uh, pack these in. Actually, let me just move this out of the way. So you'll get a piece of white foam like this with yours. Um, you probably won't have a leather mat like this to set it on. So I recommend you do is when you set it face down, set it on this and don't let it shift around um, this is very soft foam but you can still mess it up and I'd like you to keep this in this condition for a long long time uh, these will last forever in fact if you don't get fingerprints or water or anything on them ever then uh, they'll literally stay looking like this forever toss the bolts out This finger groove allows you to easily take the money out. And if you so desire, I've had a lot of clients use this space down here, which is made for a backup credit card or backup ID or something like that. A lot of my clients that want to give away more than 50,000 in cash, they'll put some gift cards down in here as well. So that's a good spot for gift cards. Uh, but that's it for this one. Uh, giveaway start uh, this week. 
Uh, what we're going to give away yet, I don't know. I'm uh, levy, having people put suggestions in the comments of the videos I'm making now. I've heard uh, Dallas Cowboys Brick, Dallas Cowboys Coasters. I've heard all kinds of recommendations. So anything you'd like me to give away, name it. Um, if I pick whatever it is you want, then I'll make it and I'll send it to you. So I don't have some elaborate system for picking this. I don't get a whole lot of comments in my videos, but I do want to make sure that whoever's consistently leaving comments on my videos, that's who we're going to give something really cool to. And maybe it's a brick like this. Maybe it's a brick like this. Down the road, when I get, say, lots of subscribers, maybe we'll fill a brick with real cash and uh, send you a brick full of cash. That would be kind of cool, too. Or actually, for something like that, we'd probably fly you out to Vegas and present it to you in person. So I appreciate you guys watching my videos very much. I really enjoy making this stuff. This is a lot of fun for me. So I appreciate you guys. Take care. God bless. Peace.